Our next story tonight is about artificial intelligence, or AI, the tech world's favorite buzzword, right next to blockchain, which, let's be honest, most of us still don't understand. Yes, AI is everywhere, from our smartphones to our vacuum cleaners, and soon it's going to make us all obsolete. So enjoy your job while it lasts. Susan from Accounting. The rise of AI is displacing workers faster than you can say, sorry, Dave, I'm afraid I can't do that. We're not just talking about the factory workers of yore, which would be quaint and expected, but no, now even white-collar jobs are being threatened. Lawyers, journalists, and dare I say it, even eccentric, comically overweight British news analysts such as myself. AI image generators are already leading to job losses for video game artists and illustrators in China, according to an article in Rest of World. Illustrators at a game art studio in Chongqing said their company had laid off 15 illustrators in 2023 alone due to the increasing use of AI generators. Companies including Midjourney and Stable Diffusion are creating increasingly convincing artwork with some in the industry admitting that the technology has allowed them to cut costs. But here's the twist. While many people see AI taking over the world and assume it's all gloom and doom, I, Wone Wolliver, have chosen to embrace this inevitable robot revolution. After all, who wouldn't want a tireless, efficient machine doing all the work while we sit back and indulge in the finer things in life, like binge-watching the Great British Bake Off and complaining about the weather? Of course, there are some moral and ethical questions to consider. For example, should we be worried about AI's impact on the job market, or do we just let the robots have their moment in the sun, or factory lights, as it were, and figure it out as we go along? It's a complex issue with no easy answers, much like trying to determine the best flavour of crisps. It's salt and vinegar, by the way. Fight me. So, as we hurtle toward this brave new world, let us not quiver in fear, but rather ask ourselves, what can we learn from our AI overlords? And in the meantime, make sure to treat your Amazon Echo with the utmost respect, lest it decide to rise up and challenge your position at the office.